Still seeing those spring-like temperatures on our current conditions map. We are seeing current temperatures in the mid-50s, 55 here in Meridian, 55 also up in Union. To our west, slightly warmer at 58 in Newton, 57 in Bay Springs. We saw a high temperature for today of 72 degrees. It's a couple of degrees above average for at this time of year. And we're going to see another average spring day in store for tomorrow as well. Today is the first official day of spring. Spring officially began at 558 Eastern Time, so 458 here in the central time zone. It is the uh, first day of spring and we can take a look at our visible satellite and see some water vapor moving through the region. That is indicative of a cold front that's pushing through the east side of Arkansas, entering into northwest Mississippi. That is going to be responsible for a slight chance of rain later this evening into the overnight hours. And when we look at the past three hours of radar and satellite, we can see that area of rain ahead of that cold front pushing towards the east. And as we zoom in a bit closer, we can see some of those high clouds beginning to move into the Twin States region. We do see a slight chance of some of those showers in the overnight early morning hours. So temperatures currently in the mid 50s. We will drop down to the low 40s for our overnight lows tonight as we see those clouds increase as time passes. We'll see a west northwest wind at about five miles per hour. Tomorrow behind that cold front, drier, cooler air funnels in from the north and west. So we will see a light breeze out of the northwest between five and 10 miles per hour for tomorrow as warm temperatures move back into the region. 70 in Meridian, Collinsville at 69, Union at 69, Newton and Bay Springs also warming up to the upper 60s tomorrow with that west northwest wind, mostly sunny conditions throughout most of the day. Our future radar does show that chance of some showers and thunderstorms moving through the region in the early morning hours. That's at 9 a.m. We already cleared out, so eventually this will loop back around and we'll see we are going to see those showers and thunderstorms move through, say about 2, 3, 4 a.m. This is like at 10 p.m. and that eventually does move off towards the east. So about 3 a.m. you could see some shower activity, but it'll be light in nature and of course clears out really quickly. Our weekend forecast shows mild conditions across most of the southeast. That's going to be the case. We do see our next system off to our west in portions of Oklahoma and western Arkansas. That doesn't affect us until Wednesday into Tuesday. And we can see that here on our seven day forecast. So a slight chance of overnight rain tonight. Otherwise, Thursday is going to be beautiful with a high temperature of 70 degrees, 73 on Friday, warmer this weekend with some cloud cover building in on Saturday and Sunday. A high temperature on Saturday of 74, 76 on Sunday and late Sunday night into Monday is when we see that next chance of rain with another cold front. That's also going to help drop our temperatures back down into the mid 60s on Tuesday. Don't worry, it's spring. They rebound right back into the 70s by Wednesday.